I am Anil Kumar sharing with you a test question on related rate of change. The equation here is water is added to a cylindrical tank of radius 2 meters and height 10 meters at a rate of 100 liters per minute. Find the rate of change of water level when the water is 6 meter deep. You can always pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestions. So here is a small sketch. So we have a cylinder which is kind of like this. We are given here that the radius is 2 meters and the height is 6 meters. We are also given that it's being filled at a rate of 100 liters per minute. So that means rate of change of volume with time is 100 liters per minute. Positive since it is being filled. We need to find rate of change of water level that is we need to find I mean rate of change of height with respect to time when water is 6 meter deep when height is 6 meters. Correct? So that is what we need to find. Uh, we are given that the height is 10 meters. Okay, so this is 10 meters. Right, so 6 meter will be uh, somewhere here, let's say. So at this instance, we have to find rate of change of height. Let us see how to do it. Well, this is seemingly straightforward question. We know volume for a cylinder is pi r square, which is the area of the base times height. So what is rate of change of volume equals to? Now remember one thing, as you can see, the radius is constant. It is 2 meters. Do you see that? So we know R is constant. Perfect. Therefore, the derivative will be pi R square will be as such and derivative of H is going to be dH dt. This is important to understand. So don't apply product rule or something and make a mistake. So that could be one mistake, correct? Now we can isolate and find what dhdt is. So we have dhdt as equal to 1 over pi r squared times dv dt. Now let's look into the units, which is another critical part of this question. We want we are given all these heights in meters, right? Okay. So the radius is given to us in 2 as 2 meters. R is 2 meters, which we need. We don't need height or anything in this formula. It is independent of height. That means rate of change of height is constant. Do you see that? It is constant. Whether the height is 6 meters, 4 meters or 7 meters doesn't matter. However, we are given rate of change of volume as 100 liters per minute. We need to convert this to meter cube per minute. Do you understand? We need to convert this to meter cube per minute to use radius as 2 meters. So what is that conversion? What is that conversion? So we know that 1 meter cube is equals to how many liters? Is equals to 1000 liters. Therefore, when I say 100 liters, so 100 liters will really mean 0 0.1 meter cube. So it is 100 liters per minute. So that will be 0 0.1 meter cube per minute. So now we have what dvdt is, correct? So we can say that when height equals to 6, that is dh dt for height equals to 6 meters, rate of change of height is going to be 1 over pi r is 2 meters so 2 square times dv dt is not 100 it is 0 0.1 perfect and the answer will be meters per minute do you get this point so that is the answer that is the answer so the exact value of course is 0 0.1 over 4 pi or uh, we can write decimal 
it is how much so 0.1 divided by within brackets 4 times pi so it should be in brackets otherwise you could do another mistake is it okay so it gives you 10 to the power of minus 3 there do you see that so it is uh, 7.9 let's say 6 uh, times 10 to the power of minus 3 meters per minute right so that is you could write this in seconds by multiplying it by 60 uh, so you get around 0. Point, we could be 0. 0.477 seven uh, meters per second correct and you can times it by 100 to get 47.7 centimeters per second perfect so you always do some conversion of units as convenient however most important thing to understand in this particular question is to take care of units right so this is indeed equals to 0 0.1 meter cube per minute and that should be substituted here for rate of change of volume to find your answer. So I hope that point is absolutely clear. Feel free to write your comments and share your views. Thanks for watching and all the best.